Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is very exciting because we are going skiing. So we're going to Avoriaz in the Morzine region and I'm really excited, I haven't been for two years, I've only been the once, so this is my second time skiing. It's just me and Sam going, I'm really, really excited and I need to go and meet him. He's just straight off a night shift, bless him, so I need to drag our mahusive suitcase, which weighs a ton, hopefully under 23 kilos, and let's go. Did they tell you off your kick cans? Not kick <laughs> Are you excited for the holiday? Yeah. <laughs> You've been looking forward to this for a really long time. I know. And Sam's, Sam's just off night shifts, by the way. How are you feeling? Fine. You look great. You look great. <laughs> Currently, like we've just driven through Morzine and it's later than we thought, isn't it? Actually, we thought we'd be able to get our skis and get our ski pass and stuff tonight, but it's gonna have to wait till the morning, unfortunately. Oh. It's cold, it's about minus three. How cold it was. <laughs> so, we've just got here, and I don't know, looks like looks like we're walking to the hotel. <laughs> Did you expect this? I didn't know what to expect. We thought there'd be basically everyone in Avoriaz is by horse and carriage because there's no cars. Um, so I just kind of imagined like, I don't know, Gilly style. You'd get there and there'd be like horse and carriages. But oh, we will find somewhere. <laughs> bedroom oh it's just so nice and warm I'm so happy my feet are literally like ice <laughs> and then um what's in here toilet great oh it's really small <laughs> little bathroom and then this is the little lounge area oh my god oh wow oh wow this is amazing, we have an outdoor fit. I don't think I said, but we're here for six nights. So it's gonna be nice just to unpack and chill and ski. And I'm so excited. We need to get food now and do a little bit of food really shop. Cool. I know, so cool. This Are you happy? Yeah, yeah, this is actually like really nice. We've effectively got something that can house like five people here. So yeah. It's <laughs> it's basically like Christmas round two. So I'm packing, Sam's bought all his stuff here ready for tomorrow and we've unpacked our food. Look at all my protein. I pack whey bots because I like to have porridge in the morning when I'm skiing and a little bit of protein will keep me fuller for longer. I also bought some of my favorite teas that I'm loving at the moment. I've got the Pukka nighttime one. Um, I've got Chia one, which is no caffeine. Obviously, you need this a nighttime one. And then this cleanse one as well. I'm just really into my teas at the moment since I've been trying to cut out coffee a little bit more. And I've also got some Grey's nuts. Um, Livy's kitchen because yum. And this protein bar because these are delicious. Our rooms keep because we've got a little um, ledge in the shower which is so handy 
and we've unpacked all our stuff here and then <laughs> and then in here I've put all my stuff voila just told me like have you felt the pillows oh my god no cotton wool balls why why do they do this this just reminds me of a few times when traveling, like the camper van pillows in New Zealand, and also what was that other place, Sam? Well, I mean, Philippines as well. No, I'm having the better one. Why would you want to put your head on like? Oh, it just makes, it really makes me feel sick. <laughs> Thought I would do a quick run through of what I've packed, just in case you're going skiing and it would help you. So. Here I've got like loads of socks, two pairs of ski socks, and my salad pets obviously, my jackets in the other room, gloves, everything in the other room. I've got base layer top, so I've got quite a few, I've got a couple of sweaty betty ones, and then some like generic cheap sports direct ones um, there. And then my mid layer I've just got a black fleece. Last time we were skiing I literally like hardly ever wore the fleece because I was too hot. It went in February to Val Turen, but I think it was milder, whereas it seems quite cold now so I think I'll need that. Then underneath my base layer tops I always wear like a sports bra, so I've got a three here and then I've got four vests as well um, again they're all are they all yeah they're all sweaty betty these ones are really good so I wear a sports bra a vest a base layer top mid layer as a fleece maybe and then my ski jacket and I've also got a buff like a scarf thing as well and for my legs underneath my salad pets I wear um, one of these I've got old sweaty betty base layer bottoms and just some like Nevica ones and then these are thermal leggings from sweaty betty as well which I'll probably wear in the evenings um, I've just got underwear there more socks at the back and then here I've got um, a really warm thermal top, a pair of jeans, a down jacket in case I want to wear that instead of my ski jacket, two other hats, um, and then I've got two really cosy jumpers as well. There's just a few other bits in the wardrobe, but I'll probably just end up wearing the same jumpers like all the time. <laughs> um, and then yeah, like I said, in here I've got another hat and all my gloves, my goggles, um, and that's it. And my backpack, my ski backpack. Because when we went skiing two years ago, I, when I was on my own quite a lot, because basically I was a beginner in Sam can ski, I was like, but I want to carry water and food and like, you know, all those necessities. So we got a backpack and it was just a lifesaver. I can put like tissues and stuff in there. Hello. Are we going to get food now? Yeah, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Mega snowstorming. <laughs> it's so snowy. <laughs> So we came back with pizza <laughs> because everyone was really busy and we're just really hungry. Oh my God, look at these. Oh yeah, we've got four cheese and pesto and smoked ham. So there has been so much snow that someone <laughs> is actually just like clearing up a little walkway here outside the front door. Oh my God, there's literally, it's snowed so much over the way. So I'm just getting ready to go to the supermarket. You're gonna get us some breakfast. Yeah. First lunch. <laughs> and lunch and wine and beer and yeah, all the essentials. Bit of bubble bath. Bubble bath. <laughs> I'll show you what we get when he gets back. Let's check you out. You look great. Off you go. Brave the snow. <laughs> this is what it's looking like now. Ooh! My god, the sound of visibility is awful. <laughs> so, we've got blueberries for our porridge and some like lettuce mix for the sandwiches, crisps because crisps. And we've got apple juice, yum. Bananas. What's this? Ooh, red wine for me. Was this expensive? Cheap? Nice, cheap. Nice. Um, what's this? Milk. Um, water for today. Coffee for me. Coffee? No, for me as well. <laughs> I want a coffee. <laughs> um, we've got some soap because there wasn't any here. This looks nice. And pesh. Pesh, is that for your beer? That is for the beer. <laughs> okay. Uh, these are nice bags. And we've also got jam for the porridge. Raspberry jam, yay, yum. We've also got oats because you can't need oats to make porridge. Um, we've got foil for our sandwiches, um, cheese, another water, and ham. Is that everything? Oh no, and oh, there's also some other things. Butter and bin bags. Nice. <laughs> what about toilet roll? Well, I think you've got enough. Is there just one? We've got coffee, we're going to make sandwiches, we are making some porridge. Oh, nice hair. <laughs> How's the porridge? Really good, but I'm really nervous. Why are you nervous? 
I'm scared I'm gonna be bad. You'll be great. It's gonna be so much I fun. Don't fall over. I'm scared. You have to fall over. It's, it's part of it. It's, it's intentional. Managed all right. So hot. Yeah. I like these. Yeah, they look nice. All right, let's get outside. It's really cold around my chin, <laughs> my neck, and it's quite a grey day, as you can see. But I'm doing some blues, and I'm doing them good. Aren't I good? You're doing really well. I'm so impressed. Well, he's actually impressed. You're not falling over yet. <laughs> I'm not falling over yet, <laughs> and it's good. We started on some greens, and then I was like, this is just really boring. <laughs> so yeah, we're doing blues, and they're doing going good. And yeah, we're going to eat some food because we're starving. You know, we're not even skiing for that long, but hashtag. because the visibility is not the one. <laughs> We're doing some mega chilling. I've even got a duvet. I may or may not have fallen asleep. I love how the tables have turned. So French food shop part two. We've got another really warm, freshly baked bread to make sandwiches tomorrow. We've got some iceberg lettuce, some potatoes for dinner tomorrow, some blue cheese because France, and we've got honey and some better jam than the one this morning. It's like got bits in it. Um, some really nice lint chocolate and some of these yummy looking biscuits. Um, we've also got tomatoes, raspberries, steak for tomorrow night with green beans, um, eggs, because I, I wasn't full enough with the porridge. I think eggs with the porridge will be good, separately, obviously. We've got these, like, crisp bread things, maybe to put honey on. Um, some lemon tea. Sam's not feeling very well. I'm not feeling 100%. We're hoping it's just, like, from all the, like, wind burn today and just general, like, skiing, but... <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully we'll both feel better after a long sleep. And um, we've got some salt for flavouring things, some creme fraiche, um, some cheesy biscuits and some bog roll. <laughs> and that is it, and some more ham for sandwiches. Voila! And now we are going to go out for dinner. I have plait curly frizzy hair and I can't really bother to put on makeup. I just, I think we just want to go to bed, but we're going to go eat and maybe have some wine and go to sleep. Good morning. <laughs> Check out the visibility, it's not good. And we feel a little bit poorly, so we're gonna go back to bed. <laughs> and hopefully this will clear up. Morning. We're mega chilling because there's, I mean the chairlift wasn't running. The chairlift just started running, but it's covered in snow and there's like no visibility whatsoever. <laughs> that's the chairlift that we need to be running to get home basically, so yeah. no point skiing if that's not running. It's so we might go out a bit. Yeah. I'm just watching these people stuck on the chairlift. It hasn't moved for a while. <laughs> and I'm just editing this video in the comfort of this wall apartment. 
That's so mean. Oh, is it moving? Oh, off they go, they're moving. Yeah, just go for a little. It's gonna go ch test out some blues. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> 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 Great. <laughs> really I need nice. a wee really bad. <laughs> Don't need yellow snow. It is day three in Avori Asmal and the chairlift isn't running again. It's like 9.30 now. Um, I mean, I think some of them are, but it's still snowing really, really heavy. There's so much snow. Um, I'll show you again. Just check that out. The visibility is really bad again, so we're just gonna head to the supermarket and stock up, because it looks like all we do is go to the supermarket. Um, and then we are going to head out and see what it's like. Um, it's meant to be really nice the next two days, which are our last like full two days. So we're really looking forward to that because I really want some blue sky. There's nothing better than skiing with like blue sky and sunshine. So fingers crossed or at least the visibility is better and it's not snowing. Because that's the thing, you just get so wet because it's snowing so much. Are you going to take me down some more blues? Yeah, we're going to go down some more blues. Yeah. We might try and go to a place called Ardon today. Ardon! But that was all closed yesterday so we'll see. Yeah. Come back from the shop with some warm panna raisin and croissants. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to eat these. All the lifts are closed. Everything's closed, like, we can't get down. We literally can't get anywhere. Like, nothing to do. It's raining now rather than actual snow as well. So basically, the goggles are just like fogging up and covered in rain. And to be fair, I'm not really enjoying it. So I'm actually quite glad that the lifts are closed for the sake of me not being able to ski properly. Um, but yeah, I think Sam's gonna go and do some skiing this afternoon, but it's just not the one. It's really annoying, but we've got a really nice hot chocolate. Position's not so good. <laughs> We're like visibility watching. There's only two lifts running, like, and there's about four pieces that you can do. I'm a bit bored now. Can we have some <laughs> nice weather? I'm going to end the vlog here. We didn't end up skiing very much today, as you probably saw. Sam did some skiing on his own, but we didn't go to Ardon, Ardon. Um, but we're going to try it tomorrow because it's meant to be nice weather the next because few days. Because it was closed, we wanted to. Because it was closed. Loads, basically loads of the chairlifts. Everything chair lifts. was closed. Everything was closed, apart from two lifts. Um, so Sam did what he could, and I edited this video, which you are watching now. So we are just chilling tonight, and then we're going to make a nice chicken bacon pesto pasta, which I'm really excited about. 
and yeah, I'm gonna have a bath now, wash this fluff, and then tomorrow is a new day, and hopefully sunny, or at least clear, and we are going to smash the skiing. So that's gonna be coming in the next vlog, is Avoriaz part two, which will hopefully be a lot more of like, nice skiing and nice scenery and stuff, rather than me just like, you know, doing a food shopping haul and showing you what I pack. Oh, by the way, before I forget, with my ski base layers, when I did my what I packed for skiing thing, I said that I wear these under my salopettes. I actually haven't been wearing these under my salopettes because I'm warm enough and salopettes on their own are fine. So, don't know if that helps anyone. That's a bit of a generalisation. <laughs> Depends on the conditions. We've been skiing. Yeah, quite a down if you are skiing up high, you're very, very down, you might Can we not? Just saying. Hashtag just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling the story now. It's my <laughs> blog. My vlog. It's all mine. Ha 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 ha. Anyway, we will okay. end the vlog here. <laughs> and yes, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like the video if you enjoyed it or if you've been to Avoriaz. And please join us for the next one. We will see you in Avoriaz part two. Bye! Goodbye. <laughs>